Google Tech update. Wait, that's more like it. Google Tech just released the best update in a while. With one of the craziest minimaps they've ever added in the game. Even with one to two secret cosmetics that aren't these. Now, if you've been busy and haven't played this update and you ah, been too busy, here are five things that you missed in Google Tech's new update. Even if you have played this insane new update and you feel like you're missing something, this video is for you. But I think you should subscribe right now or next match you play this sword is gonna get you. Ah! What is happening? To a brand new mini game mode. Why is second floor open? Bruh. Wait, they added nothing up here? Wait, why is this actually open? Wait, new golden hat? No? Now let's get started with number one. Whoa! The new basement map. Well, where the most of this is gonna be. But you might want to stick around because I'm gonna figure out what's inside of here and what's outside the map of Gorilla Tag. Look how bright it is in there still. Let's start with the minimap itself and, well, the game mode. You walk on in and you, well, shrink really small. And in the middle, there's a massive soda fountain. And then when coming down here, you don't want to step in this. When you step in this, you basically change the color. Well, it can be washed off by, well, going in here. Now, this stuff is mainly known, but this is mainly for people who haven't, you know, played. You take a Mentos from up here and you throw it in. One, three, four, five, six. Just like the volcano. Just like the volcano. Ah! That happens so funny, because the second you get tagged by this stuff, the round ends, and it goes all the way back down. As you can see, it stopped making noise. And also go in here and watch, well, these things go and tet the ground. If I like Cub Cub, why is there water balloons around the map? Well, I'll get to that in one moment. If you're playing this mini game mode, you want to climb to the top as much as you can. You can actually jump on these bubbles right here and, well, launch yourself with them, allowing you not to touch the ground below. Or you're probably running around like Cub Cub. I didn't miss any of this. But I know something that you did miss. You see that this vent actually opens and, well, it sucks all the stuff down. Going into a public lobby, you can see this guy's photo soda, but I hit- <laughs> I heal him by hitting with a water balloon. Wait, 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 you can go under the vents? I can't leave. No, no. You're going to try and see if I can actually get in the vents again. And if it gets to the top, it gets, well, covered with bubbles, ultimately. Oh now, if I'm down here, you can see almost, well, any potion, except you can't go inside of them unless you glitch. No. Oh, number two is some glitches in the game. There's a lot, even including you getting a free cosmetic. A very simple one is just grabbing the rope from the outside, like gripping. Yeah, now you're just a soda color. Bruh. This can be used anywhere in this map. Come up here and you push the ceiling. You, well, freak out, like a lot. And the outside view is just even funnier. What the hell? Help! Help me! Oh, ah, ah, ah. Now early I said something about this treasure chest. They probably think, well, you can just glitch in. And you can't. Help me! I'm stuck. Help me, I'm stuck. Help me, help! Glitch that's not really a glitch, is you can put your hand up through here, all the way through this tube, and just tap it. As you can see, I can make the light red, and go buy it. Right here, press it. Right here, you press it, and you can basically buy it. But I'm just too broke. As soon as you come down here, it's, well, still open. Kind of like if you bring your hand down here, and if you have long enough arms, you can actually do the Mentos. Or make the water balloons full size. As you can see, I hit him. I like to do this to help other players and monkeys that are in trouble while, while it's rising. You can move all around the map and it has a massive splash radius. And make sure not to get stuck like I just did. Oh no, my hand is... Over to the shop and you grab, well, the paper airplane. Now if you grab this paper airplane and, well, just throw it and walk outside, it spawns back on your arm. If I go to my holdables, it's not there as well. Better demonstration. Have it, you can't really go near that or this happens. No. But after that, you can literally throw it as much as you want. You can actually double it by tapping it too much and... Now as you can see in this clip, there's two paper airplanes. Paper airplanes all type of messed up. As you can see, I have two cosmetics on one arm. And yes, I can use them both. Hell no, man. What the Bruh. Can you see my paper airplane? Did you see that? Right on this one and fling up, nothing happened. Right on this one, fling up, nothing happened. Slid my hand in between here and win AFK for a second, and now I can just. Yet another glitch, well, this update has. And up and out I am. That was so easy. Outside of the map, let's get on to number three, which is really just cosmetics. With one being this airplane that I can, well, throw across the entire map. Bruh. Now, coming over here, what you want to grab is that, that, this, this. No, there's nothing really special or stuff they can do. It's just, when Dimension after doing the paper airplane thing, you can have two cosmetics. 
It looks something regular and just make a bonking sound, but going over to a glass and tapping on it. And the weird thing about this is on ice. See, two cosmetics. Top watch right here actually tells the time after you click it and it goes in a full circle. Even when on your arm, it tells the time and it just keeps going until you stop it. Now keep in mind if you want to equip it, it re-equip it, it resets. Another magnet. It's really odd and it just connects to literally almost anything. Even your hands, which is really, really cool. It can even connect to the paper airplane. But it doesn't connect with any of the metal stuff at all. If you want to know what this does, it kind of... It's like the bubble gun, but it just shoots circles. Now number four. The absolutely horrible map changes. Life Force is super fun and it's really cool. Doug the Bug also lost his hat. I think he's going a little horn up here. The rocket ship is still there, it's just not showing. There's these two things from last year, which everything is almost from last year. Uh, they had an icicle right here and basically everywhere. But you can't jump on them, because, because well, they're icicles. They, you kind of slip off of them, so I have no idea why you would. Now, not much really in the caves, except... Actually, nothing, never. They did get rid of the mini-map. So, Matt the Bat's hat, which I don't know where he is. I found Matt the Bat, and, uh, yeah, he's, his hat is, oh my god. You know what, I love you, Matt the Bat. Drown, drown. Matt the Bat, you're so amazing and awesome. Come on, come on. No, in the canyons, also literally nothing, because why would they add something? I'm not expecting too much, because, well, we're probably going to get a winter update in a little bit, and they had time to change some stuff, and it's not really a major update. Get out of here. The rocket ship is back with nothing on it, not even a hint. Comp course is, well, completely the same. This should really be called, like, map inspection instead of map changes. Really, if I went in there, would there be anything different? There was nothing there. This, which everyone thought there was going to be a capture flag game mode, because, I mean, look at this. Capture flag is literally right here. Now, obviously, the big hitter is there's, well, tons of stuff in here. There's absolutely a massive amount of, well, items new in here. With every single post in here being absolutely changed to, well, a different thing. So, how long will this stay? Probably a long while. There's none, and they're all gone. Lucy, what are you doing here? Lucy, Lucy, get out of here. How did you even get... That's really it for map changes. It's not a lot, but let's get on to secrets. Well, there's like none. So I'm going to get a couple of people in here, and we're going to unlock this for real. I walk here. Walk over here. And let it hit. And now, oh, you should have it on your arm. Oh, it's mom. Oh, I can see it. Yes. Why can I see that? You're not supposed to be able to see it. Wait, can you see this? Can no, see no, I can see. I can see his. Too. What? It's coming. Water balloons. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Good idea. Good idea. Get over here. Get over here. The bubbles aren't forming. Bubbles are not forming over there. Jump. Get over. Get on the bubbles. Get on the bubbles. Get on the bubbles. No. No. Oh my god. No. Tag me. It doesn't tag me. How does he die? It doesn't tag you either. Oh yeah. Oh. It tags him. I had to fling across the entire map. Oh my god. Lucy. Do you guys have a soundboard? Chase. No. Lucy just got chased. No. That's it, you guys. If you guys did not know one thing, you have to survive. The store, brand new. Uh, how do you guys like it? Is it good or no? I feel like some of the time should have been spent out here, but also the cosmetics in the store are absolutely amazing. Everyone buying almost any cosmetic in the store. That's another video. Bye! Survive you, Chase. Survive you. Get the storm up a little bit.